interesting there. Gallardo, Portuguese local swimmer, goes in lane number three. Paralympian from Beijing. There's the world record holder, Lucia Bikina. She's been looking in great shape this week. Ellen Keane showing some good form coming into these championships, but Nura Marquez Soto has been in fantastic form this week, the Spanish swimmer. Well, Vladikina using very much a traditional start style, not bothering with the plate at the back of the block, which allows for a track start, using a grab start. Well, look at her stroke turnover. The girls on the side of her, well, now stroking at least twice as quickly as she is. And well, we've seen this a lot from Alessia Vladikina, where she will just swim just about fast enough to make the final tonight. She's so good that I think that she can afford to do this. But she's still just keeping touch with the leading ladies. But they are having to work so much harder for that, well, really, not much of a lead that they've got over Vladikina Paul. Yeah, it is Portuguese swimmer, Johanna Calado, based in Manchester in England. She's a Paralympian, of course, for Portugal in Beijing, trying to make it to her second Paralympic Games. Ellen Keane going well for Ireland. Harry Keane not in the picture at the moment. And Calado will get in to the delight of the home crowd. 126.74, some cheers here. Ellen Keane in second, Marquez Soto in third. And Ikina in fourth position, 134.41. Very happy, Joana Calado there from Portugal. She's delighted with that one. Whoa, Portuguese. The Portugal team's youngest Paralympian in Beijing in 2008. She made the final in this event. She's back again, <laughs> celebrating that heat swim. Fantastic stuff there. Calado, great swim from her, great swim from Ellen Keane. But... Adikina, well, again, as we see it again, Giles, some of the favourites for this one, just taking it easy when it comes to the heats. Well, I haven't had the graphic up yet, but by my, my reckoning, that makes Claire Cashmore through fastest. Alessia Vladikina, well, she's going to end up in one of the minor lanes on the outside. Is the result of heat number two, Greek swim 